let's see, where could it be? Okay, yep, the signal is getting much stronger now. Maybe it's over here in this area that the other thing was. That'd be interesting. Let's, uh... No, that's not what I need. Wow, that's really strong. Whee! Whoop! Hey! I think I found it! Uh, examine. This is the windmill's uh, windmill propeller you were searching for. Now possible to achieve these using the robot whose services we have enlisted. Would you like me to call the robot? Yes, please. I will send word to the robot using telepathic transmission, Master. At AKA, she is using singular wireless to talk to him. Now placing your call. Wow, that that call went through real quick. Wow, we get great service down here on the surface of the, uh, the, the Earth. Mr. Shreve, if you weren't waiting long, so you want me to carry this? Hey, Mr. Shortpants, you're in my way. I said get out of the way. Wow, how rude. Be waiting for you up in the sky. Don't take too long. Alrighty, now that we've got the propeller, we can, uh, get that all fixed up. We also return to the sky and collect the propeller as soon as possible. You know what? That's a good idea. I say we do that. Uh-oh! No! I didn't expect that we could actually drop down that. thought it was just kind of like something that it's like, Oh, look, there's an invisible wall here. No, they actually didn't install invisible wall there. And they're just like, you know what? Let's just make it so that the, the player can actually fall down at this point. Not like one of those other baby Zelda games where it has invisible barriers everywhere protecting you. No, that'd be that'd be too uh, stereotypical of us. We had to we had to change things up. Exactly. This game this game's all right. It's pretty interesting. I can say that. It has its good points and it has its bad points. I will say, though, if it had traditional controls... Hey, the robot! If it had traditional controls, it would be a lot easier and, uh, I think a lot more enjoyable overall. And if I can, I want to get through this zoomy hole. The zoomy holes are quite fun, because they make you go zoom! Wow. That was a long away warping spot. Silk cloth, silk cloth. Wow, it sent me right here as well. Robot, you coming? Yep, there he is. Here's that windmill propeller. Zat. Zzt. You need me. Clang, feel free to call. Mr. Sphi, I'll travel any destination. Wow, that's what you call robot love. Whoa, isn't that the beat up old robot from Gonda's place? Wait just a second. Is that? It is. That's the windmill propeller. Things must have been falling down below the clouds. The whole story handed out through Gondo's family was actually true. I get the feeling this all some elaborate uh, prank. I guess I'll try to fix this thing. This goes in here, and I'll just crank that a few clicks. Aha! Phew! That ought to do it. If you can find some way to spin the propeller, you can probably turn the windmill around. Hey. Honey, honey! Oh no, I think I might I might have promised my wife I'd fix our cover. I swear that woman's always be looking for somebody. See you around, Link. Bye, Elvis. See you later. Maybe have some peanut butter banana sandwiches. <laughs> I don't know. We gotta rotate this thing. So I'm guessing we gotta rotate it till it's at its blue spot, just like the other one. That would make sense, I guess. Let's just get it good and rotated. Come on, Mr. Propeller. Uh, let's let go right now. Okay, it's blue. Whoa. Whoa, what is this? That is quite interesting. Huh. Hang on, I'm going to... What is... Oh, it's... 
I've never seen this before. Okay. I'm gonna go over to um the other um I'm gonna go over to that island and see if now I can actually go and recover their missing object, because that would be nice if I can get that out of the way right now. Oops! I will be right back. Oh hey, the guy has dots now, so I'm guessing we can do it. Let's go ahead and speak to him now. What am I gonna do? It's no use, it's all over. What's wrong? You see, the party wheel that I pinned to my uh, back flew off the island and it fell down somewhere below the clouds. With my party wheel, there's just no way I can make this island a place where people can come to have fun. What can I do? It fell down below the clouds, so I guess I should give up on it. Look for it! How am I supposed to go get something that fell below the clouds? That's impossible! Your dowsing ability can be calibrated to look at the item this person seeks. However, if you're searching for another object that someone asks you to find, that target will be removed when you switch to this target. Do you wish to set the party wheel as your dowsing target? Uh, yes, please. Understood, Master. I will calibrate your dowsing ability so you can assign the party wheel as a dowsing target. There we go. Dowsing ability set. 90% chance the... Item will have landed in the Lanaru Desert if it fell in this vicinity. Alrighty, let's go investigate the deserts. Be so amazing somewhere to find it. Just think of the smiles on the children's faces. I'm not getting my hopes up though. Don't worry, dude. We'll find your party wheel if it's the last thing that Link does. And hopefully it's not the last thing that Link does, because he's gotta still find Zelda. Oh wow, that's interesting. It actually remembers which uh if you've used up any feathers for the last time you've been flying. That's pretty cool. Alright, let's go down into Mr. the Lanaru Desert area. Or Mrs. Lanaru Desert, I don't want to be prejudiced in here. There we go. Down, down, down into the... area. Let's point to our destination. Uh, let's center that. Let's go to the, um... Stone Cache, that seems like a good area. Yeah, let's go there, why not? Seems as... Best air here is I need to go. Sailcloth, sailcloth. I didn't sailcloth. Tee hee. I fooled all of you. Alright, let's set our dowsing to, um. Oh, it looks like the party wheel's up that way. Let's take a look. Okay. Uh oh. That Ampharos guy is kind of, uh. I keep wanting to call him an Ampharos, even though I think that's not his name, because that's just a Pokemon name. Looks like it's in that cave up there. Can I even get up to that cave? Let's check. Go up! Ah, oh, shoot! Go up! Ah, oh, how am I supposed to get up there? Uh-oh. Shoot, that guy's been alerted to my position. Oh, crap, I can't- I forgot the cactuses aren't our friends. Maybe I have to get this amp guy to come over here so I can jump on his back and, uh... Or maybe it's as simple as going over to the starting area and... I don't know, I have to figure out this riddle of the Sphinx. And it's quite a mysterious riddle, it, that is. Uh, doesn't look like we can get, our, get at it anyway from this side. Because that's not climbable. I'll find this out. Count, you can count on me, duder. Alrighty. Let's see here. Where was I? Oh yeah, I was trying to figure out the uh, the so the um, way to get up to this uh, area here, and I think I may have figured it out between the uh, time I took a little break there, got a bit of milk, and I had recalled, I had remembered that I was like, oh yeah, they have these uh, these rocks over here that I need to bomb, and I figured that might as well I bomb them and see if there's anything below. And sure enough, there's a time crystal below this one here. And striking it... ...makes things green. Yes. Back here, look! There are vines! 
So we will vine the vine and uh, get another uh, ancient flower to uh, for our compensation prize because I think we ended up using one whenever we... Uh, I don't know if we used it or we just kind of like got the oils from it. I don't like quite know the details of that, but now we can... Um, looks like we can uh, go across this uh, ledge here. And this is how we'll get over to that area where the dowsing ability is telling us the prize wheel is. And then we can go have fun with playing things. And wow, that's a deep hole. And there's a chest down there. And there's, looks like the prize wheel. Examine. Identify the item. The highly unusual man on the fun island says was lost. Yes, let's call the robot using singular wireless. Yes. Beep, 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 beep. Boop, boop. Hello? Hi, uh, your friend here is on Who Wants to Be a Millionaire. He is using his phone a friend ability and uh, he has chose you to be the person he's going to call. Alrighty, here you ready? You got uh, 60 seconds. Yes, strangely familiar. Oh, hey, you know why it seems strangely familiar? It's because you've been here before. <laughs> Stay out of the way, Master Short Pants. Don't take too long. Alrighty, so now we've got the prize wheel back. That's cool. Coolio. We head back to the sky and return it to the owner as soon as po- Own owner? Why did I say it like that? I want to see what's in this chest down- Whoa, that was close. What's in this chest? I gotta see, my curiosity's getting the best of me. What is inside? got a goddess plume. You got a goddess plume one. Nice. Those are pretty cool. Alrighty, that's now where are we at? Aha! We are somewhere. Somewhere is to be known as up here. Aha! This is how that area connects with itself. Alrighty. So, I will meet you guys. Actually, no, it's not too long to get to the, um, uh, not terribly too long to get to the nearest owl statue. It's right over here. Uh, let's go to the sky. No! Uh. To the sky. Yes. Jeez. Sometimes this um this menu selection's a bit finicky. When I try to hit yes, it the thing just whacks out and goes over to the no side. It's like going over to the dark side. It's like, no, you're not supposed to do that. Master Skywalker. Alrighty, Mr. Robot. We want to go this way, with, this way with the prize wheel. Because this robot, I mean, not this robot, this clown over here wants it back. So, Mr. Robot, if you will follow me, we shall return it to him. Woo! And he will be overjoyed that we got it back to him. Wait a minute, how many gratitude... How many gratitude crystals do we have? We have 40. And he wanted me to come back when he had 50. So I believe this here will give us 5 gratitude crystals, if I'm not mistaken. Alright, let's land back down. He's so unhappy. But look what we brought! Here's your wheel thing! <sighs> Plang! If you want something else, just let me know. <laughs> is this? Is this? It is! It is! <laughs> Yahoo! My party wheel! <laughs> Thank you so much! Now I can realize my dream of opening Fun Fun Island! Woo! I'm so happy! And I'll let you be my first customer, young man. Thank you so much. It's going to be so much fun. Yay, Star Bits! You've got five Star Bits! Yes. Lots of gratitude. In crystallized form. Got it. Alrighty, so now can we be a customer? Jeff, a little man. How are you entering to find my wheel? My dream of creating my very own... S very smiley, fun, fun island has been realized for all to enjoy and to laugh and la about. 
You're only a charge 20 rupees to play, but since I owe you, I'll let you play your first game for free. Free is so much more fun than pay. Yes. Hey, then, let me tell you all about the rules. First thing you need to know is you'll be shot out of a cannon. You'll fly way up there. Don't cry, little boy. It's perfectly, mostly safe. Well, is this OSHA compliant? Your goal is to dive onto a uh, cheery, colorful, rotating board, land on a happy little colored space, and you'll win rupees based on the color. But if you land on the gray space, I can tell... I call that the loser space! Then I get to reach in and take a handful of your rupees. Isn't that fun? We're scaring that it went big here at Fun Fun Island, but it's a game of luck, so uh, don't come crying to me if you land on the loser space. Ha <laughs> ha! You're diving. Super fun fortune rings and dodo balls will appear like magic. If I see one of these fortune rings, you'll increase the awesome rupee score multiplier. Ooh! The more rings you pass over, the slower the wheel will spin, making it easier to land on your target and win! Getting one of those dodo balls will reset your multiplier and turn your smile upside down. You can't use your sailcloth while diving. Did you get all that? Sounds like fun! Right, wanna give it a try? Yeah, sure. <laughs> And explain the rules one more time? No. I don't want to hear that again. Righto! Brave little guy. Hop into the cannon and plug your ears. Hi, I'm the bomb on buddy. I'll prepare the cannon. <laughs> ready to get in? Uh, ready to blast off? Hop on in. Wow, this is just like the bomb on buddy cannon, except it's slightly longer. Two, one, try! Oh shoot, this is gonna be difficult to control. Just gotta work on passing through those rings. Looking out for the balls. Two, four... Six. Oh no! No, 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 no! I missed! Gosh darn it. I missed again! Ah, oh, no! Finish! Ah, I missed all those things. I needed to get them. Crap, that's hard. <laughs> Whoa, you won. Uh, look at the nice space you landed on. A run rupee spot. His multiplier is six. You got six rupees. Yes, five. Yeah, 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 yeah. Six rupees. What? Let's just spend some time here burning some rupees. Yeah, let's just shoot you out of a cannon. Gonna have to pay this time. Uh, I'm in. Yes. Yes. Alrighty, the bomb on buddy prepared a cannon. So let's just go ahead and hop on in. I'm actually gonna stand up for this because this is actually kind of difficult to do. One, drive. Yeah. Alright, you just gotta keep concentrated on those rings. What? Oh my gosh, how did I miss again? What the heck? I went right through it and... Uh, this game's controls sometimes are just so annoying. Like, I went right through that one. How did that not count? Uh, shoot, 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 shoot. Oh, blue rupees. <laughs> This is not too. S I don't like this. This is weird. <laughs> Five rupee spot. Oh, hey, I, I I profited. I mean, I didn't. I mean, I got um, I broke even though. I got twenty rupees. Okay. <sighs> I'm gonna have to pass through all of those rings and land on the spot. But uh, how am I gonna be able to do that? <laughs> Yes! <laughs> yes! This guy's so weird. And then, uh, assuming I can pass through all the rings, there's no, like, there's no, um, guarantee that I'll actually land on the, uh, two, one, drive. No guarantee that I'll actually land on the correct space I need to. This is gonna be annoying, I just know it. Uh, no, 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 no. Whoosh. No, no! Oh, gosh darn it!
game's really hard. No! Gosh darn it! Lose your space. Shoot. Ten rupees. Dang. That sucks. Two. One. Drive. Alrighty, come on. Just gotta follow these rings. Two. Four. Six. Eight. Shoot, 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 shoot. No, I missed again. Oh, gosh darn it. No, not a f No! Oh, space. No! Rupees. Alrighty, come on. Two. Four. Shoot a ball. Oh, what? Why, why am I falling so much faster now? Alrighty, let's just at least try to make some money here. Oh, well. Ugh. Not gonna work if I don't fall. Okay. I at least made six rupees. Jeez. Gotta memorize this board here. Dang, that space is in between two loser spaces. That's not good. Yes! I did it, guys! I did it! I did it! Yes! Yes! 500 rupees! And I got all the rings, and I got a special prize! Peace of heart! Yes! Yes, 500 freaking rupees. Did I even make a did I make does that mean I made a profit from this? That would be shocking if I did. Holy crap. That that was that that's the happiest I felt in a while. My god. Yes. Thank you. I'd like to thank all the little people out there who have followed me throughout all the years and who never gave up on me. I couldn't have done this without you guys. I thank you all and I wish you all good luck. And now, I'm going to save this game. I'm going to stop this recording. That way I can start a new one. Oh yeah! Woo! Yes! Oh man! I feel like I am... I can do anything now. I am... I any I can do anything now. I'm the king of everything. All the things I can do. Sailcloth. Yeah. I did it. I am the master of all things. All the things. And now it is forever recorded on my Wii. Thank goodness. See you guys next time.